Ryan, just chucking on the way over there, you said it was a game of two halves. <laughs> yeah. Uh, listen, the first half, I thought we should have been out, out of sight, and we've known that. That's been the case for probably a large part of the season. But then the resilience and, resilience and the character that I'd shown in the second half. Listen, we knew Stephen was going to be tough. Tough to break down, three strikers getting in our three defenders' faces, solid, resolute, as a Graham Wesley's team are. And yeah, it was tough to break them down. Uh, but listen, just pleased with the character and the resilience of the boys to, to find that winner. Let's not talk about it, Stephen. This is what I asked because it was all about us today, wasn't it? Yeah. So many chances you created, so many good flowing movements. I mean, you must be preparing at half-time. Listen, the flowing movements, that, that's us, isn't it? In a nutshell, we, we, we play that style of play. And you know, when, when you're playing it fast and quick, First half was, second half we as quick. Yeah, but we believed, we, we believed just, you know, you might get one or two a little bit on an iron, but we believed that we, we get one more chance. Um, and we believed that the patterns of play we play and, and, and the overloads we play and, and the passes through the third and through the lines, we know we're always going to create chances. So, yeah, that's a given for us. Yeah, it's just that last little bit. It's, it's a great win. You know, your, your defender who's, who's been solid as a rock for us. He pops up there towards the end of 96 minutes to, to get the winner. I was going to say, I know you don't like talking about individuals apart from the team, but Naz, he, he's, laid the, he's laid the first one on effectively. <laughs> he scored the second one, he's been spraying passes around like Franz Beckenbauer. Listen, he's been excellent for us, and, and for a, a guy who didn't play many games last season, and, and, and probably coming to for a, a, a bit of unfair criticism, I think he's been a breath of fresh air. On fair play to him, you know, he's, he's down here at Alta's family, he puts a shift in every single day. Um, and he's, he's one I'm very, very pleased with because the way we play, the style of play, he asked for a chance and he got it and he certainly took it. Um, he's been a breath of fresh air, so fair play to him and only that continues. And we have to remember he's doing it with, 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 a, with a, a serious illness, basically, which he had to yeah. Yeah, listen, yeah, he has obviously type 1 diabetes, which he, which he handles well every time I see him. He's putting a bloody needle in his stomach or something. <laughs> but he's different class. Listen, along with Scotty, uh, Gaz, you know, Will when he's fit, you, you know, Josh again has gone into the left side of centre half yeah. tonight is, is superb and you know, so look we, we, we know we know what we you know don't want to praise individuals and, and you know they get praise off me and, and the coach and staff. But it's nice when you know you can praise one or two individuals every now and then. Because along with Alex they've, they've been a rock at the back. You talked about keeping on going, and it was important because it got a bit bitty in the second half, didn't substitute in the injuries and all sorts of things like that. But to keep going and then to keep a cool head right at the end though because I thought no I finished very well for you know, it did, yeah. but again listen sometimes you can come back to bite you can't it you know you, you, you play games and going down and whatever else and that's just football at times and you know you come from park you know try and see it out in 96 minutes and then you know we score the, uh, the, the 30 seconds ago which is which is a big plus for us because we haven't had one of them this season it's gone against us mm. quite a bit so it's good that it showed the resilience side of things which I'm obviously pleased with to get it. Yeah, it's a little bit different from what we're, what we're about and the ball into the box and you know, high balls in, but look, sometimes you have to do that. Uh, but no, listen, I, I always believe that the, the boys in the group, the subs coming on making an impact, could make sure we got one final chance. And you can see what it meant, not just to the crowd, the players, everybody, it was one big explosion of joy at the end, wasn't it, really? Yeah, but there's that, and you know what, sometimes it's tough, right, because you know, and I know like we didn't play the best in the second half and it weren't quite free flowing like we normally do. We know that, but look, these lads are putting everything in. You can't, you know, you, you can't criticise them. That's their second game in what, two, two three days? Mm -hmm. And I've just yeah. said there, they are a bit on the floor now, tiredness, and we'll make sure we record them properly. But please just, you know, stick with them because they're giving us everything. You know, compared to what they've been used to last season, you can see the football, the style of play we're playing. And the lads are putting bodies on the line. Yeah, there's a lack of quality at times, a little bit, but come on, I think it showed uh, the resilience of the boys to get a 96 minute winner. And I think that was joy for every single one.